Have you ever tried plotting date on your X axis and time on your Y axis? If you have, you don't have an option here other than aggregating it as a count or count distinct. So all you have to do is first, let's get into the Power Query editor. Over here, let's select the time column. What I will do is I'm gonna go to the add column tab over here and then click on time, go to hour and then select hour over here. So I have my hour separated from my time now. I'm gonna repeat the same process here to also get the minute as well. I'm going to add another custom column. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna bring in hour followed by a plus sign and then I'm going to bring in minute here, divide that by 60. I'm gonna close the bracket here and confirm. And now let's make sure the data type of this column is set to decimal number and let's close and apply. Let's go back to our line chart now and see what happens. Let me get rid of this and bring in the HM column that we created into the Y axis. And now you see that our line chart with time on the Y axis has been created.